we are about to see a fight courtesy of the Empress of Tomorrow. The pageantry before the punishment. The following is a triple threat match. Making our way to the ring, representing the Kabuki Warriors from Osaka, Japan. Eccentric, erratic, dances to the beat of her own drum. Don't let the bright colors fool you. There is no one in this division more dangerous than Asuka. She truly believes that nobody is ready for Asuka. Well, look at everything Asuka's done here. Grand Slam champion. She won the Royal Rumble, dominated everyone she's faced. Asuka has all the reason in the world to believe that. The EST of WWE. And her opponents, first from Knoxville, Tennessee, Bianca Belair. Just signature exuberant energy. Now, Belair is always ready for her next big moment. And always highly motivated to be the best at everything she does. Listen to this ovation. The WWE Universe loves cheering on the EST. Well, come on. Her energy is just infectious. I see Graves even dancing over there. Uh, I'm not sure I'd call that dancing. The one and only Charlotte Flair. Perhaps the greatest competitor in the history of the women's division. And from the Queen City, Charlotte Flair. Hey, if you want to create a legacy in the WWE women's division, then Charlotte Flair is the mountain you have to climb. Yeah, there's no one even close to the amount of accomplishments that Charlotte has. The WWE ring is her unquestioned kingdom. Charlotte will stop you and then leave an imprint of her boot tattooed on your face. Highly skilled in every facet. Strength, brawling ability, risk-taking, mind games. No other women's competitor has been so decorated, so revered. Charlotte Flair is ahead of her time. True greatness usually isn't realized until after you've been enshrined in the WWE Hall of Fame. Such is not the case with Charlotte. Just open your eyes and experience the greatness. Whether you like it or not, no one can measure up to Charlotte Flair. She was bred for this business and has become the absolute pinnacle. She really is the biggest challenge there is in this women's division. With these three superstars, it's going to be interesting to see where this triple threat matchup goes. Set for action in this one, and we're getting underway with Asuka, Bianca Belair, and Charlotte Flair. It's every competitor for themselves, gentlemen, and I guarantee all three superstars are thinking about that right now. I honestly can't imagine thinking about anything else in a triple threat match. I understand going into this with a strategy and a plan, but I have to think that flies right out the window once the bell rings. 
face first with a waist lock takedown. Oh, backing it up there. Oh, you know that. Slam down. Sharp knee. Oh, caught on the chin. Ah, snapmare takedown and a into the ring now. And an impactful display of offense we just witnessed there. Oh, stop right to the hand. Each of those boots seem to get heavier with each blow. Corey, what sort of game plan works for a superstar going into a triple threat match? You absolutely need superior ring awareness. Far too often we've seen superstars forget about the other opponent and end up getting blindsided. Running interference. Set right into the corner. Kick! Oh, kick connects. Ouch! Here's the takedown. Hooked up. Oh, shit breaker. Trap now and just that sharp elbow. Lives to fight another day. No telling what's underneath the ring tonight. She's ready to do some serious damage courtesy of that steel chair. She shows that she's far from finished. And a lift up power bomb. What goes up must come down and it sure as hell did right there. Suplex. Really just laying it in. Asuka might have just been rocked there, which is usually something she does to her opponent, not the other way around. Yeah, Charlotte was really showing off her unmatched skill. Oh, man, Charlotte just bending that leg to her will. Charlotte suplex. Watch her set up in the corner. Charlotte just rubbing it in now. She's surely revving up, but she better put the rubber on the road already. All right, she's back in, ready to go. And she denies Charlotte. Vicious boot by Charlotte. Oh, yeah. oh she can end it here. Kick out before the one count. Not even close. Chair shot delivered. Caught with a punch. Got a leg drop, Bulldog. Belair really found herself in the wrong place there. Hanging tough as this match progresses. No easy task in a triple threat match. A stop in the leg. Just nasty. She wants to take this one outside the ring, it seems. And Asuka is stepping up. Ooh, sharp elbow. Taking this to the floor. Check your face after that one. Oh, what a chop. That'll let you up. Get slammed down. And now thrown back into the ring. Face buster. Charlotte Flair making clear she has her number. She's starting to drag a little bit. It's expected, Cole. In a triple threat match, the target on your back is twice the size. <laughs> Bel Air able to adapt. Getting set up for something in the corner. And that was a successful bit of offense with that maneuver. Knees, knees, face. Yeah. 
And this match will head back to the ring. Oh, and she got out of there. Oh, 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 some hope. Nasty chop delivered by Shawn. Followed by natural selection. Does that finish Bianca off? Makes the cover. What a kick out of two. This is the kind of fortitude that stars are made of. Bianca is proving she can take on anyone's best shot. That did not work out in Charlotte's favor. Can she turn to something else in her arsenal to finish things? Asuka setting up. Hip attack. Excellent. Bianca Belair learning there's no sidestepping danger against Asuka. And Asuka wins. Here is your winner. What a performance. Huge win here in this triple threat match. I have to say, I'm just as impressed by this win as the WWE Universe. Triple threat matches are no joke.